On Thursday, we found out that the U.S. GDP dropped a record 32.9%, the worst contraction ever. In the meantime, the president of the U.S., Trump, toyed with the idea of delaying the U.S. election, something that even many of his supporters consider dangerous and a fascist move. The U.S. weekly jobless claims also rose for a second straight week. Meanwhile, the U.K. is worried about the second COVID-19 wave in Europe. Welcome to the Tick Mill Update. I'm Kiana Daniel, the founder of the Invest Diva Movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tick Mill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your Forex trading friends. On Friday, we'll be watching out for GDP numbers from Spain, Italy, and the Euro area, as well as the PCE price index from the US. Today, I'm looking at the dollar yen pair, which seems to be on a free fall towards the lows of March at 101, as investors dump the US dollar and turn to safety in the Japanese yen. With Goldman Sachs also warning of the risk of further USD devaluation, we could expect the bears to win this game in the medium term. Now, do you think there is hope for the US dollar recovery? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tick Mill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates next week.